No day quite like leg day, wouldn't you say? Great training for a hortator like me. Get them calf muscles nice and stretched so I can become a hortator for other houses. Yes, sirree. What's up, Frostal Bros? Welcome back to the Morrowind playthrough. It is currently part 37. Last we left off, we became Horde Tour for House Lalu. Now, as you can see, we are outside of Scar, because next we are becoming Redoran Horde Tour. So we're just going to have to head on in here and learn a little insight about the counselors. So we're just going to have to head on past the guards and... Basically, all the different counselors are set up in a circular formation that there's the main hall, but right here should be our first counselor. I'm, of course, also going to show y'all where this guy is. So, once you enter in through the front entrance, you usually want to go into the bedroom areas. That's where the, all the counselors usually are. And we're going to have to get some intel on where all the counselors are and who they all they are because we really need that information. But this right here is one counselor. We're just going to save on up because we're going to want to use ourselves a nice charming spell on him to try and actually coerce him into accepting us. So now that he has a disposition of 100, let's talk about Horde Tour. How do you expect anyone to believe such a story? All this about prophecies and reincarnated heroes and Daedra lords appearing in caves. I've also heard that you are an imperial spy, but enough talk. I judge a man by his actions, and I don't know how much about yours. I will speak with the other counselors, but that is all that I will promise. Alright, and of course, we're speaking of murder and counselors, we're going to have to get the book because that will actually tell us who everyone else is. But of course we're going to have to talk to other Red Run counselors about uh, Red Run counselors later, because we need to actually have names so we can get locations, because currently the Red Book just tells us names and generalized locations, but you can actually get exact locations if you actually talk to the Red Run counselors about Red Run counselors. I know that sounds confusing, but hey, that's just more wind logic for you. Anyways, we're just going to have to head on out here and go to our next it. counselor, who should be somewhere, essentially. As you can see, we got ourselves the book, and of course, uh, the first counselor we spoke to, he did not believe our story. We need to find a counselor who will believe our story, and I think I know the guy. So if we just go right across from here over to this place in the Sarithi Manor this should actually be where we can actually get a proper quest so let's just talk to him alright I am counselor Horse tour you have told a remarkable story if the ring of truth uh, you may have been deceived, but I believe you. I may be able to persuade other counselors to believe you as well, but as a condition uh, of my support, I require a favor. Rescue my son, Barvor Sirithi, from Venom Manor. What happened with Barvor? He's my son. He's being held in Venom Manor, which is uh, the first manor to your right when you enter Scar. I have heard Bolvin Venom is keeping him in the right wing of his manor. You must be careful not to kill Bolvin Venom himself, or the other counselors will not like that. Okay, so yeah, we're going to have to go on an investigation. The thoughts ran through my head as I headed out the door. Where could they possibly keep the young Sarethi? What kind of sick sadistic freak must Borvin Venom be to kidnap someone of his own kin? The guards don't even seem to properly care or acknowledge the kidnapping. How corrupt is House Redoran truly? 
These questions I must find answers to. But these questions being in my head in the first place make things unsettling, to say the least. I should continue my investigation and in a manner itself and check the right wing. As I entered, I immediately noticed drag marks, brutal guards, and every single person here looking at me side-eyed as though I'm an outsider which I most certainly am. Such an unwelcoming feeling felt disturbing to a certain extent, but I entered the right wing and followed the drag marks past some guards who seemed well armed, but they seemed like nice people for now. There was a weird tapestry, but right behind it I found a locked door. There was also drag marks leading to it, how strange. I must get my own DC open door, see if I can find to uh, find out whatever these drag marks mean. After I open the door, that's when the case cracked wide open. I made sure I could see perfectly well as I gazed upon the kidnapped victim. I approached cautiously preparing myself for the fights up ahead. Did my father send you? Oh, please, we must travel together. All right. With the person following me, the guards attacked, but after some diplomacy, they seemed to understand. But they let me know right away that the guards upstairs wouldn't be so persuasive. So, I had to head upstairs and prepare myself for a battle to come. This battle would truly be legendary. After all, House Redoran is known for its warriors. acting aside, we got the sun over here, so we're just going to have to, I guess, bring him a little closer since he doesn't seem ready. There we go. You, you have rescued my son, and I am forever in your debt. 
You rescued my son. Words cannot express my gratitude. Therefore, I must name you House Surrender and Hortstor. I also promise that I will use my influence to the other counselors of House Surrender. And alas, there is one obstacle. Borven Venom will never name an Outlander Hortstor, but uh, you will have the full support of the other counselors. Uh, you may agree to a duel, though. The duel is an honorable tradition dating back to at least the founding of Rhodesian. Each party to the duel makes an agreement to the, com the competition that will be given to the winner. The loser is legally bound to this agreement. Most duels are fought uh, until the party admits defeat or falls uh, in battle. The duel is uh, the duel to the death is less common, but only ends when one party is dead. The winner to the duel may take what he wants in the loser's possessions, but some consider this dishonorable. All right. Now, with that out of the way, we're just going to learn everything about all the counselors. You can, of course, uh, pause at any points. So, yeah, this here's all the counselors. We are going to have to talk to every single one of these people in order to become Redoran Hortator. And Morven Venom is going to be peeved off by this, and he's going to invite us to a duel, which we're going to kick his behooty in, and I mean absolutely smack him with my Jinx Blade, but that's going to be in the future, because currently that's actually going to be it for the rest of this video, I hope you all enjoyed, and remember to like and subscribe, check out my other videos, and yeah, see you all in the next one.